did you get? Beer and beer. Uncle Leo's Uncle Leo's Porter. We're beer showing beer. We're doing reviews tonight. Okay. So, what's your favorite beer? Then? This is pretty good. I like yeah. the smokes. What's the, t what's the name? I'm not sure. Uncle <laughs> Leo's. Ah, the same thing. All right, bye guys. Hey, bye. Amy, yeah. Thank you. This is what? It's a smoked corner? Actually... That's the seventh. Seventh. That's seventh. Wait, 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 wait. It's not official till I see it. Give me... That one. Pardon? The German Altmer? Ooh. So it's a German Amber Lager with a bit of Noble Hawk. Nice. You don't say frig off. Oh, I gotta give you a frig off, man. Ah, uh, frig off, man. <laughs> uh, so I've had uh, puck off. Now I have the frig off. Frig off, the better one. God damn it, man. Double <laughs> shot. So, I've had uh, puck off, now I'm having uh, frig off from Nine Locks, uh, Dartmouth, Nova Scotia. So far, the frig off is freaking good. I like it. Easy, easy drinking it. Oh yeah. Where are you guys from? Uh, I'm from I'm Greystone. Greystone. Awesome. <laughs> I, I visited Where are you from? New Brunswick. Uh, Bathurst. Uh, we visited you guys uh, last summer. We tried the uh, wait 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 Patagonia. Uh, what's your best seller this year so far? Patagonia always. Patagonia. It just keeps keeping up there. Constantly. Awesome. What's, what's your best seller? Uh, I want to try the new one. The new one? Double track. We got two. We double got track? Yeah, we have a double track. Double we, have, we have a beer called the Single Track Pale Ale. And we just amped it up for this festival, if anything, to a double track IPA. But we also have... Uh, rhubarb sour. If you really like this, oh, okay. So you want I, the double? I don't. I don't like yeah, rhubarb. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. It's a, so you're gonna have the double check right now. Correct. And you can I, even have two. <laughs> I don't like rhubarb. Is this him? This is him. Anything but rhubarb. Greystone. Hey, we. I've been doing. We've been doing this since six thirty. How you feeling? We're from uh, Beer Show NB. 
I visited you guys uh, last summer. Uh, I can't remember the, the woman's name. Justin. Fuck, man. <laughs> Pause. Like I Actually, hold on. So, in the booth. I'm going to take you to the drink. So, right now, I'm at the Greystone booth trying out the. Double track IPA. Double track IPA, yeah. IPA. It's just being released today. Just released tonight. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hey, we'll be we've been filming since 6 30. I got in at this. Uh First, is, first impression it smells like IPA. Well, that's what it originally was. We just we haven't we have the APA version. We just got yeah, it. Out. So that's great. That's a good thing. That's good. Honestly, it's gonna be a seven point five. You're what? Seven point five. Well, that's pretty much what the ABV is, so perfect. <laughs> awesome! <laughs> Thanks, man. 7.5. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty much like a bit under there, probably. So, yeah. so your name is? My name's Dennis. Dennis? Yeah, Dennis Goodman, yeah. So, credit to Dennis for being cameraman for uh, five minutes. Five minutes, yeah. I'll give five you more if you want. I'll, I'll give you my ranks. Oh, we're good. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, thank you for Greystone. Come back. Thank you very much. Thank you, man. We'll be back. Yeah, man. And uh, yeah. we'll have fun in Frederick. Yeah, that'll be a blast, actually. All right. Yeah. Thank you, you very much. Yeah. All right. Thank you. I didn't get your name. My name is Norbert. Norbert? What's your best beer? Uh, what is all that like, guys? What's your best beer? All right. We'll do it. I give you guys a nine. Oh no, they got flat. Nine. Look here. Where are you guys from? Lunenburg, Nova Scotia. Lunenburg. said it was supposed to be there uh, last month. Some stuff happened, but we're here now. <laughs> but what we want, what, what we want to do is visit your uh, brewery. Excuse me, excuse me for my talking because we've been doing this uh, since 6:30. Anyway, we're going to visit you guys next month, or uh, we start brewing next week. Next week. Awesome. So, uh, well, next month then. Yes, please. Sir. Next month or uh, April. April or, or May. Yes, please. So, so give me. Oh. Stout or IPA? Stout. Okay. Stout again or IPA? IPA. IPA. Stouts. I do too. Right now it's a tie between Washington and Goal. 
The more school me school. It's a tie. Because my favorite stuff is the more school me school. Part 5 of our Fredericton Craft Beer Festival. As you can see from Part 1 to Part 5, at the last part there, we were starting to get uh, pretty tipsy and our speech was getting very slurry. So, that was the, this was the last episode. Unfortunately, we didn't have enough time to do every brewery. Uh, and I know uh, there was ciders and there was other stuff. I wish we could have done it, but now that we've done three beer fests and we know how how it works, now we're gonna we're gonna go we're gonna figure out how to do it properly the way we want to do it <coughs> properly, and this way our, our uh, speech won't be too much slurred. So I'd like to thank uh, Brasse de la Côte, Denis Poirier, for getting me in contact with Lloyd of the Fredericton Craft Beer Festival. It was very fun. Uh, next year, we'll bring uh, me, Tristan, probably another one, and we'll do it very differently and try to cover everything, every inch of it, <clears throat> and feet and height and whatever. Uh, so I'd like to thank all of them. Uh, I'd like to thank Tristan. Uh, for coming with me, and uh, I'd like to thank both our wives for uh, uh, for uh, having patience with us and enduring the way we were after. So uh, <laughs> each time I drink and I drink too much, I'm I'm never angry. Tristan wasn't angry. We were all happy. It was a fun time and very fun. <clears throat> so there was one. I didn't see so I'm gonna do a review right now yeah about uh, the Petit So it's a Brut Peche IPA uh, I've tasted it uh, months ago months ago and it was alright that's before uh, we went to the Grey Rock Casino Beer Festival so I thought I'd, I'd, I'd share with you guys uh, if I can get it open, there we go. Uh, I'll share with you guys. It's a brute IPA. So, uh, yeah, it smells pretty brute, uh, brutey. So let's pour it. Oh uh, yeah, look at that. Yeah, every every. Everything of it. Pit soap. Peche. Brewed IPA. Now let's get to the tasting. Again. Ugh. Mm, peachy. You can smell the bit of the hoppiness. Not too bad. Definitely smell a bit of peach and taste it too. I like it. It's peachy and it's an IPA. I'm sorry, a brute IPA. Pish, pishy. <laughs> peachy. Uh, it's an 8.8% .8 ABV. 
Uh, from Br Brussels, Le Petit Sceau. Du Petit Sceau. In Edmonton. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Hold this beer. I'm enjoying it. It's pretty good. I hope you guys enjoyed the series. Part 1, Part 2, Part 3, Part 4. And our last episode, Part 5. Um... Mm, really good. Like I said, to all the breweries, we'll try to get there sometimes this year. Right now, it's kind of iffy because of the coronavirus. I don't it's coronavirus? It's not the beer. If you like Corona beer, go get some. It's you're not gonna get a virus. Plus, it comes from Mexico, so pff, not from China. So anyway. Uh, I know I had to cancel uh, my trip down to New Hampshire to go visit uh, White Mountains Brewing, Twin Barns Brewing, and Gagan Brothers Brewery in Bangor, Maine. So eventually I'll be there. And eventually, each time I'm going to go, I'm going to do a different brewery. So I'm expanding. Beer Show and B is expanding. We are expanding our horizons. We got New Brunswick. Uh, this summer, if all goes well, we'll do uh, Gaspi, uh, Gaspi, La Peninsule Gaspésienne. Oh, Gaspé Coast. There you go. Um, uh, I have more New Brunswick, more uh, side of Quebec. Um, if all goes well, branch out to Bank, uh, Maine and New Hampshire. Uh, so we would have to start at Quebec and we have to start at USA. I don't know if they, they, they don't like it, but uh, Merck. If uh, when I get some beer from there, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to call it Merck. Beer Show and B, Merck. So now uh, drinking this Brew IPA, Peachy, from Petit So, Brussel du Petit So, and Emmonston. I like it. Actually, I have another bottle. So, I'm not going to open it yet. Oh, well, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to open it. I uh, already did a review. Uh, so, yeah. So, out of all this, actually, I would give it the same thing as the ABV. 8.8. .8. It's peachy. Bit of IPA. It's like you would put uh, peach juice with beer. I don't know. Might try it. Try a lager with some, a bit of peach in it. Pff, never know. Uh, but uh, like I said, it smells like it. You smell the the hoppiness and the peachiness. It was not good. Um, first time I try with a peach. Next time I'll try with a probably a grapefruit or something like that. If there's a, any beers like that, like out. So like I said, eight point eight. But I said you pity so PG if you're around Emerson, drop in, go get one, and uh, go get your John Baker and your Buck Jeff, a kid you week. Another beer too. <clears throat> Sorry, excuse me. Thank you for watching Beer Show and B series of the Fredericton <clears throat> Scary Craft Beer Festival. It was held at the uh, Fredericton Convention Center on Queen Street. Um I know with the events going on, uh, everything's canceled because of the COVID-19 coronavirus. So stay safe. Uh, if you got beer at home, stay home. Drink a couple of glasses here and there. Enjoy your time with your family. Enjoy time away from everyone. Just stay with your family. Avoid, uh, like they say, uh, social distancing. Uh, two meters from people. If you don't have to go out, don't go out. I know I, I have to work, but I wash my hands. I, when I get there, I wash my hands after lunch, after deliveries. I wash my hands before I leave. When I get here, I wash my hands. Wash your hands. Stay safe. And if don't drink and drive exactly for 14 weeks or, or more. 14 weeks, two weeks or more. Stay home, stay with your family, stay safe, and stay away from the coronavirus. But you can drink Corona beer. It's from Mexico, so no danger there. 
buenas tardes. Vaya con días. See ya.